Hello, Cancer. Welcome to your love reading. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let us see what is coming your way in love. This is for Cancer. What is coming to Cancer in love? What's coming towards uh, Cancer in love? Cancer, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What's coming to cancer and love cancer, cancer, cancer? Okay. Cancer, you have love letter and you have reunion. Okay. So somebody is definitely coming back into your life. There could be some kind of renewal between you and this person even in your relationship or your connection. Okay. Somebody uh, thinks about you a lot. They, you know, they're very nostalgic about you. There's a lot of nostalgia in this connection right now. Um, let me go with a Capricorn or an Aquarius because I know Capricorn and Aquarius pulled love letter this week. Not sure what happened there. What's coming to Cancer in love? What do we have coming to Cancer in love? Cancer. Come into cancer and love. What do we have? Cancer. Someone's definitely been peeping you. There's a lot of spying going on. I'm hearing this person might contact you in a very bizarre way. Okay. This freak is going to contact you in a very bizarre way. Like a way that you would not even think that they would. Okay. So this person could pay you a visit. This person could contact you through a fake phone number. Um, you know, some kind of method that you wouldn't be expecting, okay, for some of you, email, uh, cash app, it's coming to cancer and love, but this person's definitely been peeping you, you might already know this, or you may be feeling this, that somebody's watching you, and this freak is watching you, cancer, okay, ace of wands, a new beginning is, is, you know, this person, wants to stir up a conversation, okay? Knight of Swords, and I feel like, again, this could be an air sign, but they're coming in very, very unexpectedly here. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, could be a Scorpio. When you least expect it, we do have Aquarius at the bottom of the deck here. Um, they're going to reach out. It's coming to Cancer in love. Cancer. Some of you, they could contact you through their family or through your family or something like that. It's coming to cancer and love. Can, can you tell me more? It's coming to cancer and love. Tell me more. It's coming to cancer and love. Cancer. Um, and I just heard Facebook. I don't know why. I feel like this person's hoping that there's a chance with you. It's coming to cancer and love. Can you tell me more about this? Yeah, there could be a Scorpio. They're hoping that it's not like over. This person still has feelings for you. Could be another cancer. But this person definitely like you're still on their radar. Two of Cups. Wow. This person's still in love with you. They're in love with you. And I have a reason to believe, Cancer, that this is someone that you still love as well. Don't tell me no. Two of Cups is a mutual energy. Don't tell me no. But some of you I'm hearing is, is kind of crazy because maybe you are already with somebody and this person wants to be with you. They're watching you with somebody for some of you. Okay. That's only for some of you. Please don't take that and run and go crazy. Um, but no, yeah, this person, when you least expect it, this person's going to show up and they, they are toting some kind of offer here. Um, they don't want it to be over. They've been spying on you. They've been watching you this whole time and they're going to talk. They're getting ready to speak to you. Okay. Uh, it feels like this person wants some kind of heart to heart. This freak wants a heart to heart. Okay. They want to, they're coming in here expressing their feelings. Tell me about this tower for cancer and love. I feel like for so long, 
this person was afraid to reach out or to say something to you. But it's like they're coming out of this fear and they're reaching out. They've just been thinking about you a lot. <laughs> You've been living in their brain. You still live in their heart. Um, and that's what's going to push them to reach out. Yeah, and I feel like this freak sees you looking all good. They're very attracted to you. They're like, oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, they miss you. They're, they're yearning for reconciliation. The Page of Wands. A lot of communications coming out. I feel like this person is going to think about you so much. They're so damn curious. You know, they're so nostalgic. It's, it's going to drive them crazy, so they're going to have to reach out. I do see them take, making the first move. Uh, this could be a, the end of a no contact situation. Yeah, you guys have been in a separation, but I feel like this time apart has made this person realize, you know, what they want, which is you, a future with you. That's 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 what they want. I feel like they think about you a lot, especially at night. You got this ace of cups here. Okay. This person is their cup is overflowing for you. Their feelings are about to overflow for you. I'm telling you, this person's gonna have some kind of outburst here. They're gonna randomly, <laughs> unexpectedly reveal their feelings to you. Okay. Wow. Wow. Look at what's at the bottom of the deck. Two O cup. You and this person, you are soulmates for sure. Okay. And they still love you. Because it says reunion, more than likely, this is someone you know already. Could be a Sagittarius, but they want to resolve things with you. I do see a, a successful reconciliation here, if that's what you're wanting. They may even express to you their shame, their guilt. They may express to you, um, you know, some kind of regret. Uh, maybe if they let you get away or whatever. Whatever they've said, done. How things went down. Wow. So this person, yeah. Their cup, <laughs> their love for you is about to overflow, honey. And like I said, I don't feel like this is something you're necessarily expecting. Even if you know this person has been watching you. The Ten of Cups. Temperance. The Knight of Coins. So this person is definitely uh, well-intended. You know, they have good intentions here. Um, it may be a trust factor somewhere along within the situation, but I feel like they're, wi they're willing to um, earn it or they're willing to work through things with you or something like that. Okay. Wow, this was a crazy reading, but it was really good. It's really sweet. You can be completely open with this person. Vulnerability. There may have been some unhealed wounds or something like that that was blocking forward movement. Okay. This friendship is leading to more. You can expect the apology that you want to hear. Bottom of the deck is regret. Someone feels remorse for the way that they've treated you. Well. Prepare to be shocked with what this person has to say to you. Um, anything else for uh, cancer and love? Anything else for cancer? Oh my God. See, this freak has been watching you. They've been observing every action. All they, left, all they do is watch you, okay? True love stories never end. Believe in divine timing. Soul mirroring, exposing and revealing all. Ready to take control and lead. Yeah, you do have communication. Think the impossible, the unexpected. Fears and anxieties. For some of you, this person was very complex and complicated. 
Wow, this is this is really interesting. This person literally has been watching the hell out of you. So they're about to break no contact. All right. Um, Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yep. The silence is going to be broken. I don't really like how it's clear. Um, so thank you so much, Cancer for being here with me. I hope you found this reading helpful and I will uh, talk to you guys soon.